Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So we're going to discuss about ONCO stock and you can clearly see the price performance. It is extremely bad because the stock has been losing, uh, I mean, its levels over a period of last couple of years, which is not at all good. But meanwhile, okay, uh, you can clearly see the big fall. Meanwhile, it is creating a range, a range which is getting narrower. And this narrowness suggests that there lies a potential squeeze, okay? There lies a breakout or a potential squeeze, which will eventually start if ONCO stock started trading and sustaining above 0.26 or more. So, let's wait for the stock to surpass and sustain above 0.26. And if it happens, then obviously the stock will squeeze higher and you will see a big spurt. Meanwhile, there are two most important levels which we're going to look at and they are 0.15 which is our support and 0.12 as far as the stop loss is concerned. So first of all, please do not go below these two specific levels otherwise the downside will start again. And meanwhile, you have to wait for the stock to surpass and sustain above 0.26 or so let's say 0 0.27. Once it happens, you will see a squeeze and the price will swing higher and the least which one can expect are 0 0.50 and 1.68. These are the two immediate target and if there is anything big then you will see that this particular stock may stretch up to 7.9 as well. So this entire section will open up but it is all about probability and the price movement of uh, ONCO stock moving forward and please understand that these kind of stocks are not sustainable so even if it moves higher you cannot expect the stock to sustain at or any particular level so you have to take your profits back at an appropriate time so this is the end of the video thanks for watching